So uh, I just got back to the car. I was about to drive home. I'm gonna go through the goodie bag. Got the obligatory t-shirt, which is quite nice. Uh, oh, this, this is the medal for uh, Great North Run 2019. Um, we've got a fridge pot tuna steak. No, that ain't gonna happen, is it? Uh, there was some nice uh, protein, berry, biscuity breakfast cereals. That's gone already. Uh, Cliff Bar, I didn't try it because uh, nothing new on race date. Didn't want any GI issues. Um, got some oh, protein bites, chocolate and resin. These are really good. Thank you, Kellogg's. Could give them out on the, on the uh, run. I've got a Granger's Active Wash for all your active wear. Remove sweat and odors. What's going to be... Uh, very useful for today for the um, running top. I've got the uh, Nando's Peri Peri mayonnaise. Not really. I've uh, got some flaxseed, mild organic. This is really healthy because it says so on the back. So it must be true. And then we've also got um, some deep freeze. Oh, that's definitely going to be going on my knees tonight because my knees are hurting already. Um, and then we've got some. Um, for a blanket I didn't use, I was just trying to cool off because I was just so hot. Uh, some low salt, um, oh, some omega-3, oh, good, just be using them tonight. And then we've got some uh, oh, sun lotion and uh, soothing repairing balm for all your chafes. So yeah, so um, it's been a good event, I've really loved it. 57,000 people. Um, I should have cheated and said I was actually going to run faster than I did. I did struggle towards the end uh, after about 15k with uh, knee pain and foot pain. Um, and then from about 17, 18k on, it was really difficult to set a pace going. Uh, mainly because a lot of people were walking, which is fair dues. You can jeff it or you can just walk it. But um, <clears throat> trying to, to run in amongst all the the walkers it is really difficult it's only on one uh, one side of the road so it is very narrow um, so yes it's very difficult to set a good pace and stuff so I think I've come in, in about two hours 45 I think it is I'm still waiting for the official time and my garment is still sinking up um, but yeah it's been very hot it's my first half marathon it was all about completing today rather than competing so yeah so I'm gonna go home I've got some, um, oh yeah, so that will uh, solve many issues on the way home this afternoon. So yes, yeah, so I'd just like to say uh, thank you very much to all my uh, people who've donated. I'll put the link down below if you'd like to donate to Cancer Research UK. Um, it is quite a moving experience running around. Um, you get to see everyone's backs where people have lost their loved ones and stuff like that. It's been quite sad. Uh, respect to the Centurions, uh, strength and honour, uh, and on my command, unleash hell. Um, and there was a lot of uh, army personnel, I guess in ex-personnel, uh, that are doing stuff to raise charity for like PTSD and for the veterans, so well done to those guys, carrying this massive pack, probably 60, 50, uh, 60 pounds or something like that, uh, in this heat, and they've marched it off, so uh, well done fellas. So I'm off home, uh, so yeah, so thanks very much. See you all, uh, great enough run 2020.